uh, hello uh, today we will be make a cake despicable uh, two uh, minions so basically what we do is we needed two uh, boxes of uh, butter cake uh, you can use any favorite cake what you like so we bake, uh, mix it and bake it accordingly instruction on the box and so we level up top flip over on our working board and I uh, will find it middle so after that we just simply uh, draw a shape of our cake and um, now let's have a look it's it needs to be somewhere arms we need some arms do we otherwise it's no arms it's little tiny ones and we leave some place for the legs so after this we start trimming oh smell good once we finish our trimming this is how roughly our cake look like after this we apply our frosting I use chocolate frosting uh, you can use any frosting which you really like it if you do uh, if your cake is really crumbly, crumbly what you have to do you have to seal uh, crumbs first with your frosting then start uh, second layer is applying actual frosting to uh, do your shape or whatever Once we finish applying our chocolate frosting or any frosting what you like, uh, we take box of uh, ready to roll uh, icing and take from foil and uh, try and knead until it's nice, soft and manageable. Um, then you can put a little bit of powdered icing sugar on your working surface and start rolling. What, ro roll it uh, big enough in the size that your cake once it's bigger seems like that your cake then you can flip over on top and then we can start trimming once we flip over put powdered icing sugar on your hand and start stretching up top And uh, here our tiny feet, little tiny feet and little tiny arms. They will be here later. Once you're happy, trim it off for start far away and then trim closer to to cake once we trim away all our excess of uh, ready to roll icing I just use uh, basically one of cookie cutters large one and um, I just uh, want to make this eye see it's perfectly fit so we done one so next one uh, this is will be not not next one. This is uh, three and seven eighths of inch or ninety eight mils. This is seventy eight mils. So we're making it's a bit smaller. Just uh, yes, something like that. Don't press too hard. Just tiny bit. Just to make for you to see actual eye. So. As you can see, we have our eye. So, after this, we take our toothpick, and I already a tiny bit, tiny bit pointed, just here, here right on the middle of it, and here will be somewhere mouth, and the closer, and the arms. So, once we've done all that, what we do, we're using a yellow liquid food coloring, 
uh, for the body, uh, blue liquid food coloring for the denim uh, uh, clothes and black uh, liquid food coloring for the uh, gloves and the shoes and the rest of it. Uh, so what we do with actual, actual eye, we probably have to use a little bit of a brown. So with brown, its choice is to use uh, one of brown um, uh, food uh, edible paints uh, for the eye because it's a little tiny sort of eye. Or we can use something like, um, for example, ivory gel uh, food coloring and we can apply. So let's start it from uh, yellow and uh, do not apply too much because we have uh, uh, patterns to go so we don't want it too much and uh, um, and careful around uh, the patterns which is you already uh, outlined once we finish our top part which is eye and uh, the body now we can go for our denim uh, uh, basically clothes which is we use a blue a liquid uh, food coloring and um, we start applying blue one don't use too much make sure it doesn't uh, spray accidentally on the yellow otherwise we will get green color instead of uh, blue and yellow <laughs> Well, we're almost finished so it's um, as you can see this uh, the arms we just make actual shape of a glass but we leave this is white because it makes more looks better that actually col color whole thing is uh, black uh, basically because like this you can see actually uh, gloves for the mouse I using ivory uh, gel food coloring uh, uh, the this one it's a uh, wilton and i just applied just a second ago with a toothpick simply just like this draw something we done it right here to show our arms and now we take some of licorice that's how it comes in a like little roll you can just unroll it it's very tasty so what we can do i cut it on a small pieces uh, just like that and what we do we pierce say for example here make it little hole place it our licorice and push it tiny bit in we won't create some tiny little weenie pin here so we do for another one just place it and with help of your toothpick place it in here we are and we just keep going until we're happy with all here we place it and I think this is it will be our last uh, final decoration well we practically finished now as you can see we put all our hair in uh, you can put some more if you like so so this is actually uh, licorice, just uh, comes in a uh, two meter um, uh, roll, and you just uh, cut with knife, and uh, on a uh, looks like it resembles uh, hair, and um, uh, the um, basically that's it. You just pierce with your toothpick, and for the eye we're using as well ivory gel food coloring inside, and outline with a black gel food coloring outside. So this all is done. It's a little bit still not uh, dry, just as you can see, it's tiny bit shining. It takes about an hour and it's all be set. Well, I hope you like uh, our despicable minion. Uh, thank you very much for your time uh, with me. Uh, please do uh, leave your comment, uh, your ideas, subscribe. Love to hear from you. Until next time, goodbye.